Hi everyone, welcome to Dallas Insightful Tarot. This message is going to be a collective mini love reading for the month of May. Remember, time is fluid, so when you find it, this is the time that you're meant to see it. Go ahead and jump in. Angel Spirit, Holy Spirit, White Light, Ancestors, please read the messages that we need to know right now, please. We have egotistical proposal offer disconnected in a relationship wedding marriage committed mental health spirit um Tell me about marriage. Tell me about marriage. Insatiable thoughts of you. Okay, so somebody's married. I think it's you. And somebody's having insatiable thoughts of you. Okay. I feel like this person is very broken and disconnected. They might have mental health issues. And um, I feel like they're very egotistical to you. They're afraid of showing their true self, but they want to bring in this proposal offer to you. It doesn't have to be a relationship. Um, could be um, a business offer. Could be anything. Let's see. Tell us about this proposal offer, please, Rick. Falling in love. Okay, so yeah, they are falling in love. <laughs> they are in love with you. Oops, sorry, guys. Don't make me the camera. Okay. Spirit, tell me about falling in love, please. about falling in love. Okay, we have repetitive dreams, music, signs everywhere. So this person keeps having um, dreams about you over and over and over. I feel like they think you're meant to be and they feel like you're destined to be together. They're seeing signs of you everywhere. When they hear music, they think of you. They're wanting to open up and tell you how they feel. I feel like maybe they've had an ego death. Bottom of the deck, true love. So this person thinks you th that you're their true love. I feel like they've had a lot of anxiety over the situation about uh, approaching you. They've been afraid of being authentic. person is spying on you. Oh, interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into the tarot and see what we get. So what I'm catching is you're in a relationship where you could be married. This person has been spying on you. They've been wearing a false mask um, and they're really wanting to open up and be vulnerable with, vulnerable with you because they fell in love. Um, they could have some um, depression or mental health um, imbalances right now this person has insatiable thoughts of you and I feel like they've also been very ego driven but with them falling in love they think you're their true love okay they're having a lot of anxiety about coming in to to tell you um, how they feel but they can't stop spying on you um, they feel very disconnected by not having you in their life I feel like they think something's missing apologize I had to stop that there Spirit, 
tell me about this person. The collective is I'm trying to find it out, please. Oops. Tell me about this person that's on my collective line. You have a choice to make. Two pentacles. Or maybe they have a choice to make that. You know, maybe they're married. Three of swords. Wheel of fortune. Two of swords. King of pentacles. Yeah, so what I'm seeing is there's somebody who... Could already be in a relationship. Um, I feel like they're thinking about this choice that they have to make right now. And they're wanting to walk away from the situation that they're in. Or they're hoping that you walk away from the situation that you are in. One of the two. Take it as it resonates. Um, I feel like they've been very heartbroken though. And they feel disconnected not having you in their life. They're feeling the, the pain of not having you in their life. But they feel like... Um, that the divine has brought you into their life and I feel like they feel like this is their justice. This is their good karma. So they're gonna be rushing in with this um, very fast energy to express their love to you. And they're willing to put the struggle and mental at like anguish that they've had over you aside because they want to bring you in this offer. The King of Pentacles. Let's get any other, let's see what else. Spirit clarified, two pentacles. Yeah, they see the Ten of Cups with you. They see your wish fulfillment for this person. They want might have they might have a family already. They might want a family with you. They're manifesting you into their life right now. Okay, they're definitely manifesting you. We have the four of cups. They've been stuck in their head over this situation, not knowing what to do but they're definitely wanting to bring in this offer. It might be just kind of like an immature, um, an immature communication. They could be younger than you, or you could see them as immature. But they're wanting to bring in like some kind of flirty text. Nothing, nothing too extravagant. I think they're wanting to test the waters to see how it's gonna go. Maybe they upset you in some way. They're gonna bring, they're wanting to speak with you, I'm hearing. Okay. Six of Swords. Yeah, they're moving away from the person that they're with. They're done with that situation, I'm hearing. Any other messages for it? Yeah. You could be very kind of cold to them when they come in. They're afraid of that. I feel like they're afraid you're gonna cut them off and not wanna let them talk. I feel like this person knows they upset you in some way, but they definitely wanna bring in this offer and tell you how they feel. This person could be a Capricorn Or an air sign, Gemini, Lib Libra, Aquarius. Um, we got the cups here. With this, they could be um, with water energy here as well. We have a lot of earth, air, and water. Two 
King of Swords. It's a pair. So you guys, this is your this is your um this is your match. Any other messages, spirit? Two of cups. Mm -hmm. Yeah, two of cups. This is somebody who you can have a great partnership with. They want to profess their love to you. This person could have been very manipulated in the past. Knight of Cups as well. So, they're really taking on a lot. I mean, I feel like you could have more than one suitor. I feel like you have another person who wants to fight for your love as well. The other, one sir, one uh, could be an earth sign. Capricorn. Or Taurus. The other could be a water sign, Scorpio, or Pisces. Okay, yes, this is what I'm seeing for you. Okay, let's jump, let's see what messages this person wants to say. See what spirit wants you to know as well. Yeah, they're going to come in with, with this playful energy, like I said. Um, it's just to recapture romance. Allow your inner youthful spirit a fun to shine. Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So I feel like this person's definitely going to be making the effort to come in and to tell you how they feel, but they're going to be very playful about it. They're going to try to act like it's no big deal, but in reality, this person feels like you are their counterpart. Okay? Which you are. You guys actually matched up. King and Queen of Swords. This person's already stuck up in their head over you. They could feel like it was an unrequited love um, situation in the past. Since there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So this could have been something that this person was feeling in the past. Um, feeling like you didn't really care about them. But I feel like they're willing to take the risk, risk because they, um, they're they unhappy, I'm hearing. Okay, now let's pull some messages and then we'll end the reading here. This is just going to be a short reading. These messages resonate. Please hit that like button. What would this person like to say to my collective, please, Spirit? What would they say to my collective? I'm hearing that song. I don't know why I'm hearing that song by Nick Jonas, Jealous. So maybe that is something this person thinks of whenever they hear it I would think of you but it's uh, called Jealous by Nick Jonas I'm hearing that song in my head okay this person likes to say spirit oh, that's a lot okay oops This is a lot. Okay. We'll go ahead and take them. This one says, you have inspired me to be a better person. I'm going to surprise you soon. We were just too young. Wish we could go back. So you could have known this person for some time. I never said this out loud before, but you are my best friend. So this person is very close to you. They feel very close to you. I wish I knew how you felt. I never wanted to hurt you. The distance is killing me. I'm afraid of disappointing you. Don't give up on me, baby. They're snooping through my stuff, trying to investigate. So, like I said, this person could be in a relationship and I feel like this person's other significant partner has fell out, found out about it. 
hoping that you will forgive me. They're very fearful that you won't forgive them. I don't know what I'll do if you reject me. Okay, this is the messages that I have for you, Collective. If they resonate, please hit that like button and subscribe. If this is where we part ways and I don't see you again, then thanks so much for joining. Until next time, bye.